Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm John. This is Many a True Nerd, and this is Fallout New Vegas Kill Everything Edition. We are going to be coming up on the Boomers today, and in celebration of the fact we're coming up in the Boomers, we are going to be killing everyone with explosives. Something like this. Oh! Lovely. Time for the other perk of Esther. Esther, of course, comes with plus 10 damage resistance. So Esther's going to make it way easier for me to just sprint over to the boomers. So yep, yeah, that was literally it. That was literally it. That is all they have. Oh, you guys like explosives, I see. How about those? Do you like those? That was pretty good, right? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This lock cannot be picked. How am I going to get in? <laughs> I may have made a slight miscalculation. Is there any other way in? <laughs> oh god, I really hope so. Okay, not around this side. Oh no. What have I done? Now I know you all want to see this. Unfortunately, you can't actually do that. Um, for the very real reason and problem that if you do do that, there's literally no way to get into the camp. So for that reason, we'll just be nicely walking up to the gate right now. Hold it right there. Don't you move. How the hell did you survive that bombardment? I think we should be more impressed by your survival right now, because in an alternate reality, you just got nuked. I really think I'm scared of a punk like you. Watch your mouth, Savage. Raquel will be here any second. I'll take this from here. Oh, she's behind the wall again. Yeah, because you're standing in front of a fence. The camera often just finds itself in an unfortunate position. You've made it this far, probed our defenses, seen our faces. No, I haven't. I've just seen a pole. Come and go as you like. Help or don't help. I leave I choose don't help. All right, let's start off doing what we know we can do. Met what the... <laughs> the doctor's got a missile launcher. I wasn't expecting that. Why, yes, I have extensive medical knowledge. Don't worry, I brought my own surgical equipment. Hold it right there. You had no business treating that man. You may have spared him a lingering death, but that's straight out malpractice. Malpractice? <laughs> malpractice? Argyle has revoked your operating privileges. You can no longer operate on any patients. Oh my goodness, I'm operating anyway. That's straight out malpractice. You know what? I've had enough of your claims of malpractice. Also, I kind of want that missile launcher. Uh-oh. 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 Who's around? And do they mind? Yet. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, lovely. Is he dead? That's dead. And another one goes. Oh, yes. What a good shot that was. That was a lovely shot. Oh, is that Raquel? Raquel is using a lead pipe. Didn't work out well. She had twenty. She had twenty-five grenades and a machine and a grenade machine gun. She went for the lead pipe. Not not a great decision. Not a great decision. Boom is over there, just like gardening, just chilling out. Look, there's there's that one's just doing some gardening. And this gun, this gun gives me the ability to do this. Yep, that was a stealth nuke. Three mini nukes and a fat man. Oh, perfect. 
Also, good thing I killed this guy, because he had a nuke launcher. Well, game, as you've given me all these nukes, it'll be rude not to. I'm still going after the ants, though, because the ants are in the armory bit, and I want all the ammo in the armory bit. They said don't use flamers, so obviously that's what I'm doing. Oop! Okay, weren't kidding. There we go. Mini nukes. Grenades. Now, they also said something about don't hit the warheads. Okay, they weren't kidding. Is there any way I can actually shoot the... Uh... Ooh, yes, yes you can. And incidentally, ooh, that kills the ant up there. Nice, I think. Pretty sure that ant's dead. Ooh, what the... Blimey, did that just did that hit a warhead? I think that might have hit a warhead. Okay. Mess hall. I never normally go in the mess hall. I, I haven't been in the mess hall for quite a while, so I don't know how many people are in the mess hall. Which is why I've brought a grenade machine gun. It combines two of my favourite things. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, oh, oh, the frame rate doesn't like it. The frame rate doesn't like it. The frame rate doesn't like it. Okay, let's let's try something more powerful. <laughs> ah, ah. Okay. Too powerful. Flaming sword, flaming sword, flaming sword, flaming sword. Can't even see. Not. Uh oh, bad place to be. Bad place. Oh, they've someone still got explosives. Someone still has explosives. All right, who's left? Who's left? Who's left? That person is. There we go. Okay, I'm not satisfied. Not satisfied. I want to get a good nuke off. I am determined we're going to get a good nuke off into the mess hall. Oh god, the frame rate, Captain. She cannot take it. How are you alive? How did you possibly survive that? Oh, oh yes. That did it. Grenade launcher, you got this. Uh-oh, too close. No, not Esther. Not Esther. Not Esther. Definitely not Esther. Jihana, we got this. I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying the big guns too much, I'm going to be honest. So, yeah. Yeah, explosives. Explosives all the way. I may have slightly blown myself up a bit there. Loyal Jack? Intriguing. Where's Loyal and Jack? They're not really around here. I'm just going to check Loyal's house. Ah, there's Jack. Jack's just asleep. Bad up. And is Loyal also in his house? Yep. Uh-oh. Ah. He's got a sledgehammer. Sledgehammer versus Super Sledge. The final showdown. Okay. Okay, come on. Yeah, come on then. Oh, oh dear. Where's your sledgehammer now? Where's your... Oh dear. Doesn't even have his sledgehammer anymore. Oh, oh dear. Can you catch me? Can't catch... Oh, he's gone. Okay, he ran away like a coward. Fine. Here we go. Alright, Battle of the Sledgehammers round two. Yeah, come on. Bring it. Oh no, missed. Oh, I missed too. Oh dear. This is this is this is close. Oh. Super sledge. All right. That's all the main characters dead. That only leaves one main character. That is Pearl. Come on, Pearl. Bye, Pearl. And with the boomers all dead, that leaves only one more faction to deal with. But first, why do these robots never learn? Better. Yep, it's Gamora time. 
And you know what? We're going to try and do this properly. I'm not just going to go on a murder frenzy. I'm actually going to try and do this quest properly. I mean, if no, I've no idea if you can, given it's not actually part of my quest log to deal with uh, to deal with Gamora. So, but uh, we'll have a look around. No one but Omertas are allowed to carry guns into Gamora. This isn't Check a gun. It's a tactical nuclear missile launcher. Let's have a chat with this woman. See if we can uh, see if there's actually anything we can do. I'm calling in an outstanding balance of some information. Wait, hang on. How am I allowed to do that? Who's who gave me that tip off? Who did give me that? I don't... Did Yes Man? I don't think he did. Am I just bluffing? All I can tell you is to find Kachino. Alright, alright, alright. I've got a plan. I've got a plan. I've got a plan. And now everyone will think I'm the receptionist. <laughs> nice show. Can I really get away with this? I hope I can get away with this. Yep! No way. What? <laughs> uh, what? That was easy. Between you and I, we can break up what they're planning. Maybe save some lives. Mine included, of course. I, I, I... Sure, why not? So this is guy number one, Troik. Kachino sent me to ask you about some guns. Pick off the guards. One. Two. Three. And four. You again. Make it quick. He doesn't mind. He totally doesn't mind. I found proof of your blackmail. Give me the thermite. I'll destroy the weapons. Okay, cool. Sure you are. Sure you are. Oh, no, 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 no. Does that fail the mission? Does Troy dying fail the mission now? Don't think so. Nope, we're good. Excellent, we're good. You know you want a piece of this. Yeah, but I just can't decide which piece. Let's figure out what's going on with Clandon. Just in case you're doing this properly, um, evidence you want is this safe back here. And then you've got, uh, the authorities would like to hear the snuff tapes in the safe. I think I should kill you before you have a chance to show those tapes to anyone. What do I have to lose? Well, your head, arm, large amounts of blood. Ah. So this is where Clandon keeps his dead prostitutes. Okay, yeah, I'd forgotten about this room. This room that's got the camera in it. Yeah, it's kind of creepy. I'm just going to leave now. Thermite all placed in the room. Let's, uh... feel like I should have been further away than that, but, uh... Apparently, all fine. Good news, Kachino. I've murdered everybody. I love how Kachino just kind of sent me off on, you know, this, like, um... You know, this stealth mission to uncover the mystery of what happened here. And I've, I've responded by murdering absolutely everything. Whoops, a standoff. Who's going to blink first? Probably not the person who doesn't have a head, to be honest. Kachino, I'm on your side, man. Oh, Kachino. Oh, Kachino. I did everything you asked me, man. Damn it, man. I... I did everything you asked me. All right? Everything. Guns destroyed. That girl managed to get out of her cage somehow. Don't know how she did that, but well done. Good initiative. I wonder... Do you have what it takes? Hey, I don't have to do your stupid quest, and that is fine by me. Your quest is annoying. Love this guy, she's just kind of cast like, hmm, I thought a good time to visit the prostitutes. No! You know, I was literally just thinking, it's it's moments like this where I've just got to do cleanup that I really wish I, I could bring my big guns into the casino. But then, 
No doorman. Alright, pop outside. And straight back inside again. Much better. This should help with the clearing out of the stupidly populated lower level. Hi, guys. Beautiful. <laughs> God. Oh, what a spanner thing to do. Oh, level 24. Yay. Yeah, lockpick medicine. Bit more explosives. Level 24. Woo. Oh, so many perks. So many perks I could use. Slayer is tempting. Splash damage is also very tempting. Explosives, 25% larger of effect. Yes. Plus 50% damage with the shish kebab. Oh my goodness, there's so many good things I want. Explosive weapons. Okay. Do I want an extra 20% damage or an extra 25% range? I want the range. I actually want the range. Splash damage. Yes. I, I think I, I want to be in the cage. I feel like I'm kind of, a, you know, I'm more of a, a showgirl for gun porn. I've been through the casino twice. I've killed everyone I can find. Let's go check in with Yes Man. Don't for How many times? How? How many times? Oh, oh, I see something. I see, I see, oh. The recent disturbance at the tops has been resolved. Anyone else feel like respawning? No? Good. Yes, man, I've got good news. Everyone's dead again. Wow! You really blew up all those Securitrons at the port. Great! No problem! Are we still going on about that? Bless him. Please, go on. Boomers won't be a problem. I killed their leaders. Problem solved. Quick and to the point. I like the way you work. Now, I did try and find Nero and Sal. I cannot find them. Presumably because if you start trouble you in the... Um, in the Gamora, you don't get far enough in the quest for them to actually spawn in the level. So I can't actually tell them I've killed the leaders because I haven't killed Nero and Sal, but equally they don't exist on the map. I've killed everyone in Gamora. You got it. I won't say another word about them. There's some big news. I decoded a military radio transmission, and it turns out the NCR president, Aaron Kimball, is going to visit Hoover Dam. Now this, this is why I've been desperately staying away from all NCR settlements for a few parts. Because this means I can actually do this mission. But let's actually find out what happens to him. Well, let's find out why. Mr. House ran projections on how the NCR public will react to a defeat at Hoover Dam. Overwhelmingly, they'll blame Kimball. But if Kimball dies at Hoover Dam, there's no obvious scapegoat for them to blame. So they'll blame New Vegas instead. So... I'm on good terms with the NCR, and they will help me protect him. Well, I wouldn't say that, but they won't actively get him away. It's probably a good thing that you blew up those hundreds of Securitrons over at the fort. Controlling hundreds might have been confusing. Well, he really is just not letting go the fact that I screwed him over. I absolutely love the fact that he just keeps bringing up how much I screwed myself over there. So here we are, ladies and gentlemen, we have made it at last to Hoover Dam, and next time on Fortnite Vegas Kill Everything, we are doing a very special mission. We are doing one of my favourite missions in the whole game, which I'm very much looking forward to. We are doing You'll Know It When It Happens, and we have been tasked with saving the life of the President of the United States, which is a thing that we're going to do, probably. <laughs> yeah, um... This will be good. This will be good for many reasons. Uh, the reasons include because I really want to kill a few rangers because I want to be able to repair my helmet because you probably notice I've been wearing my helmet and that's for a very good reason.
My poor helmet was broken. It got broken and I can't put it on. And that's so sad. So I want to get my helmet back. I want to get this, the, my, creep, my super awesome creepy helmet back. So for the moment, I'm just wearing uh, I'm just wearing Manny's beret, which I took off his corpse after I killed him. So there you go. Still got Boone's beret too. Can't get rid of it because it's a quest item. <laughs> Stuck with that forever. That's what we will be doing next time. We will be going in to save the President of the United States. And uh, we'll see what we do there. We'll, we'll, we'll have to see what order we go in. Because there's a lot of people at Hoover Dam. So uh, we'll have to figure out what the best way of uh, of doing that is. Not least because I'm getting dangerously low on uh, on stim packs. Because there's no one to sell them to me anymore. And you get through them pretty quickly. So, anyway... That will be next time on Fallen in Vegas, uh, Kill Everything. One other note, um, there will be a Christmas video. There will be a special Christmas video that will be coming out in uh, on December 24th. Come back, do check out the channel on December 24th. There will be a special Christmas video that it will be very, very seasonal, kind of, sort of, a bit. Okay, maybe not much, but a bit. Um, there will be a very special Christmas video that I've put together. That will be going up on the 24th. And if you haven't already seen it, I did put up the 2014 channel trailer yesterday. I'll be linking to that in a minute but anyway thank you thank you so so much for watching i've been john this has been many true nerd and this has been fallout new vegas kill everything next time the president of the united states thank you very much and goodbye